Hey everyone, this is Spring.net, the interview series. I'm here with Kelly, who's with the Bitcoin in Austin. And tell me your full name and where we are and what you're doing here today, if you would, please. Um, my name is Kelly Neal. Um, we're here today at the Scottish Rite Theater, and uh, we're here for the Alternative Currency and Entrepreneur event. And um, we're here, here in Austin. What's the Scottish Rite? I've always been curious about this place. Do you know anything about it? I have no idea. I've never even been here before. It seems it's pretty be plush, a, though, isn't it? It's a, it's a nice antique theater. Yeah, it's got, got antiques everywhere. It's quite quite the elaborate uh, environment. Yeah. Tell me about the Bitcoin movement and how, how you're connected with that. Um, well, I'm one of the uh, founders of the Austin Bitcoin Meetup Group. We meet at Shoals Beer Garden every Sunday night on San Jacinto at seven o'clock, and we uh, introduce new people to Bitcoin. We have Bitcoin discussions. We talk about cryptocurrency. We plan events going on here in town. I'm the founder of the Crypto Women Group, which focuses on introducing new women to Bitcoin and introducing women to investing in Bitcoin and promoting businesses that accept Bitcoin that are owned by women. And uh, we, we meet in conjunction with the Austin Bitcoin Meetup Group on Sundays at, at Shoals at 7. And um, we're also, uh, both the Texas, or the Austin Bitcoin Meetup Group and Crypto Women are working together to present the Texas Bitcoin Conference, which will be happening at the Circuit of the Americas Racetrack on Wednesday, March 5th, and Thursday, March 6th, the two days prior to South by Southwest Interactive Festival. Uh, we'll have quite a few different events going on, including a hackathon, a concert, first Bitcoin concert ever. We'll have a, uh, a convention with about 40 plus different speakers, and we'll also have a trade show exhibit. Uh, we'll have a car show with quite a few different race cars out at the track. And if you register for the event by February 21st, you'll win a, a you'll have an opportunity to win a to win a race car ride around the track. That's pretty so, awesome. Yeah, we have a lot of really neat events going on. It'll be the biggest Bitcoin conference that's ever happened in the world to date. That is pretty awesome. Yeah, we're expecting at least 3,000 people. You certainly have bragging rights. Yes, we're looking forward to it. <laughs> and Shoals Garden, That's where is that located? Where you meet every Sunday? Yes, uh, I, I can't remember the exact address numbers. It's, it's off of San Jacinto, just right down the street from here. Um, and Shoals is the oldest, uh, re oldest business in Texas. They were founded in 1866, and it's the same original owner. So we like to support local businesses, and we're, we're happy to have our meetings there with them. So we have about 60 to 80 people attending our meetings each week right now. So uh, come out and learn about Bitcoin, or if you already know about Bitcoin, come talk to some people that like to talk about Bitcoin too. And tell me where... Oh, I'll tell you. I'll tell you an interesting fact about Joel's Garden. They have actually have a two-lane, nine-pin bowling alley there that hardly anybody knows about. It's kind of tucked away in the back. Oh, I've, interesting no, I've, fact I've, I learned. Yeah, recently. I've never seen that. Interesting. But tell us where people find you. What What are your websites and? Uh, how do they get in touch with you? Well, the um, the meet, the Austin Bitcoin Meetup Group website we meet it's through Meetup.com. Um, also, the Crypto Women's Group meets through Meetup.com as well. So, if you just go to Meetup.com and search for either Austin Bitcoin or Crypto Women, you will find both of our um, meeting informations. Please join our group, like our page. Um, we have uh, our, our websites, we have the TexasBitcoinConference.com, which that's where you'll find all your information about event tickets, pricing, scheduling, things like that. And then uh, CryptoWomen.org, I am actually in the process of having that built right now. It should be finished in a couple of weeks, and, uh, but that website will be CryptoWomen.org. And then uh, we have we both have Facebook pages, facebook.com slash Texas Bitcoin Conference or facebook.com slash crypto women. And we also have Twitter pages, twitter.com slash Texas Bitcoin or twitter.com slash crypto women. So. And uh, how many Bitcoins do you have? Um, I, I'm... I have a few. A few, okay. And how, how do people get Bitcoins? 
Um, a number of different ways. Um, I've received mine through business partnerships with people that are involved in mining. Um, there's a lot of other ways that you know people that are not involved in mining can get bitcoins. Um, the easiest way is to meet somebody um, or do a transaction with somebody that sells bitcoins. And if you come to the Bitcoin meetup groups on at Shoals on Sunday, there's lots of people there that are happy to sell bitcoins to you. And you know you don't necessarily have bitcoins are currently valued about. Nine hundred and fifty dollars or so at the moment, and but you don't don't feel the need to spend nine hundred and fifty dollars just to get involved with Bitcoin. You could easily, you know, buy you know twenty dollars or fifty dollars, hundred dollars worth of Bitcoin because it's broken down into the, to denominations. So basically, since it's worth about nine hundred and fifty dollars right now, you could go, you could say you wanted to buy a tenth of a Bitcoin, and it would cost you probably a little less than a hundred bucks. And uh, but the value on Bitcoins fluctuates. So that will not be an accurate number. In the Is there only one denomination, just the Bitcoin? There's no like quarters, dollars, and dimes and things like that. Um, no, I mean they do they do break them down into to smaller amounts, but they it's a percentage. Um, so for example, you know if you 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 might buy something that's point zero zero one two five Bitcoin or something like that. So it's not. It's not a, spa, a specific number. It, it breaks it down based on... And how do you keep track of your Bitcoins online? Do you yeah, have like sir, an online uh, site? That, yeah, I, you... I, have a, I have a wallet through blockchain. There's quite a few different other companies out there that can you can get a Bitcoin wallet set up through. Um, that's the, what you need to get involved with Bitcoin in the first place. You need to set up a wallet. That would be your first step. Once you understand kind of the concept and realize it's something you're interested in, the next thing you would do is set up a wallet. And if you come to one of our Bitcoin meetup groups on Sundays, um, we have a number of different tables around the room. And we have one table that's for, for new people, their first meeting. And we explain uh, the basics and intro to Bitcoin. And then we have another table that's a Bitcoin wallet setup table. We usually encourage people on their second meeting um, or their first meeting sometimes as well to um, go ahead and get a wallet set up. There's lots of Bitcoin experts at the meeting that will be happy to set the wallet up for you and they also give you free Bitcoin. They There's people there that have a lot of Bitcoin and they love to share it with new people to get them involved in cryptocurrency too. They so give you Bitcoin? They will give you free Bitcoin. If you just come to the meeting and, and set up a wallet, someone will give you some free Bitcoin to put in your wallet. It. That's awesome. Yeah, they. I don't know, maybe five, ten dollars worth or something. Yeah, but that's enough, great. Enough that's a start. That, you got to start could, somewhere. Well, yeah, and if you if you hold on to it for a couple of weeks, it could be you know thirty, forty, fifty, hundred dollars. Depends on how the values go up, but they give you enough that you can do something with and make a small transaction, so you can kind of really see how it works and realize the convenience of it. Now I've been talking to you, and, and I found out you're really smart. You know a lot about real estate and finance. Where are Bitcoins headed, do you think, in your opinion? Up. They're going to be going up in value. I mean, there, there's, before long, um, my, my business partner and I are working on the opportunity to be able to purchase, uh, or the ability to create, we're creating technology to allow the ability to um, purchase real estate through Bitcoins. So that's something that we hope to have available, not in the near future. Well, perhaps we could uh, reconnect when you get that going and talk some more about that. Yes, that would be great. We'd, so, we'd love to do that. So, Kelly, I've really enjoyed chatting with you today here at this Alternative Currency Conference, and I uh, look forward to checking out, learning more about Bitcoin and, right. and hoping you get your real estate Bitcoin venture uh, me too. off the ground. You know, that'll be great. So tell us one more time where people can find you and if you're on any social networks where people can connect with you. Um, yes, I'm on uh, I'm on Facebook, facebook.com slash kellyneal7. It's K-E-L-L-Y-N-E-A-L-7. Um, or you can email me. My email address is kelly at kellyneal.com. It's K-E-L-L-Y at K-E-L-L-Y-N-E-A-L.com. What about uh, Google Plus? Are you on there? Um, I I do have an account. I don't really use it, but I, <laughs> I hear one. that so so much. Yeah, I have enough. Google. It's the up and coming. I have though, about I think. ten Google accounts for yeah. various. I do a lot of marketing and communications, yeah. so 
I'm kind of overloaded with social media. All right, great. Well, it's been great talking to you. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you.